human beings are hurt, right? From childhood, school, college, you know, the whole business of existence. You are hurt, which is you, you have an image about yourself which is hurt. Hmm? Do you see that as an actuality? If you see that as an actuality, that you are, the very essence of you is hurt, then what will you do about it? There the past hurts and you say, and you want to prevent future hurts. Can the past hurts be wiped away so that you can never be hurt, which doesn't mean you become like a stone. Never to be hurt. See, you you never ask these questions. Ask them. So, why are you hurt? What is you who are hurt? What is the you? The image you have about yourself, no? I'm a Christian, I'm a Buddhist, I'm a Hindu, I'm uh, proud, I'm vanity. You follow? You are all that's you. Or you think you are God or superior spiritual something inside you which is above all this, which is again a personal thought. Right? So that is, the process of thought is hurt. And how do you prevent future hurts? Not by resistance, not by withdrawal, not by becoming more and more hard. Do you want to wipe out your hurts? Or do you love your hurts? Do you want to keep your hurts? There is great pleasure in keeping them, because that gives you vitality, energy to hurt somebody else. So if you want to be free of all hurts, what will you do? So that you are never under any circumstances in your relationship with the world or with your friend, what you never to be hurt. You know what it means? To have a mind that is incapable of being hurt. Hurt also, which is the other side is flattering. Both are the same. So, is it possible to end this being hurt? Huh? Do you want to find out?